Hello Zebrahood, welcome to Zebra's Arcade, a series where we try a new game every episode, and today we're trying the punch win, basically a penguin who can punch. So we'll see how this one goes. It looks like a lot of fun, a little bit of a puzzle solving, platforming, it seems like a, a really cool, a really cool little chilly platforming puzzle adventure with some really nice pixel art as well. Let's hop right into it. Because we're starting on adventure mode here. Look at our penguin. I love it. He's so chubby. But we can move and jump just like that. And there's a TV waiting for us. Oh, whoa. Okay, that makes it sort of like a retro TV mode. I think I'll keep it normal for now. But, oh, I think we just hop in to the cave below. There's a big boxing glove statue. Can I punch it? Oh yeah, no problem. Punching is just what we do. Nice. I am free. Mm -mm. I mean, welcome, noble fellow. I am the great glove, keeper of the caves. You are looking for the famous treasure of Punch Mountain, aren't you? I guess. If you manage to track the following riddle, or crack the following riddle, I will help you with your quest. Ooh. So mission one, I guess we just need to, what do I do? Oh, okay, so I can move them. Oh, you know what, I think I see what I gotta do here. I gotta break this, and then I break this one, and we have to make them line up. So this is where it is definitely sort of, you know, a little puzzle game. Nice. Mission accomplished. We get a lot of coins for that. Wow, you made it. Color me impressed. I have an important hint for upcoming puzzles. These blocks must never pile up to the top of the cave or it's game over. Now please take this little reward. We will see each other soon on your way down to the treasure of Punch Mountain. Ooh, sounds like a plan. Whoa, get a big red crystal. All right. Quite the reward indeed, look at him. So cute. Whoa. We have a lot to accomplish on our way down this mountain. But here we are. It is so adorable so far, I love it. So I guess we'll make our way through. What is this little mystery? Pola's Punch Shop. Ooh, a little shop where we can maybe spend our coins. I guess there's Pola the Polar Bear. Gotcha. Welcome to the Punch Shop. Wanna buy something? Sure. So we got bombs, which can get you out of trouble in difficult situations, place them with Y. Might as well buy one of those, but we can't really afford too much more. We have things like the fire punch, which breaks ice blocks with just a single hit, so these seem to be more long-term upgrades. We'll just buy two bombs for now to get us out of bad situations. And head right back out of here if we can. All right, off we go. Wanna check out more levels for sure. So right down here we have the summit, level one one. Here we go. So it looks like this time we'll have to match up three of those red blocks, but three times. So we'll punch whatever we can. Now can we punch down? Oh, we can punch down. That changes things up a little bit. So I will, ooh. Okay, I see how this works. Get those three over there, and we can punch up as things are falling too. So there's a lot we can do here. Getting used to the controls is gonna be a little bit of something, but in the meantime, making tons of money with these coins, hidden in the ice. Okay, get rid of that one. Uh-oh, uh-oh, things are coming down a lot faster. Oh, I got squished here a little bit. I don't know if that hurts me. Oh, I can pick up. Wait, how did I do that? I said pick up for a second. Weird. Oh, okay, well those three are gonna fall in place nice and easy. That was convenient. Let me grab these coins. Yeah, I don't know if I can pick it up or if I misread. Whoa, that's the bomb. Okay, well I wasted that. A little unfortunate, but it's fine. So there's two of them. Actually, ooh. No, I think we're fine if we just knock this over, punch it over like this, and then boom, the mission should be completed. Excellent. Whoa, mission accomplished, we get a bunch of coins. And another one of these red gems. So pretty fast paced action here in Punch Win. I like it. And that's gonna unlock a few different paths for us to go to. So what is this? This is gonna be locked until we get 20 coins, which we have. We could also go here to the summit level one, two. Let's try unlocking this, just because I'm curious. No problem. That leads to bonus zone one, three. So we'll tackle all the levels in order for now. Let's try the summit one, two. So we go deeper down, we see, is that like a stone snowman? So I need to block, match up two different types of blocks this time. Which might make things a little bit more complicated, but 
I'll knock that over there for now. Actually, that works out great, but not this one. There we go. Ooh. No, oh no, That's, that messes everything up, doesn't it? Okay, how do I wanna do this then? I guess I could maybe do something like that, punch this over, and that's three of them down. So now I could, I don't know what, what to do here. I guess this, it was gonna take some quick puzzle stuff. That's a big coin, isn't it? Okay, ready? Um, Punch that away, punch that over, there we go. Ah, yeah, that is a big coin, you gave us 10 of them. And then I can punch this over. Wait, one more time, one more time. Ah, oh, darn, the ice block's gonna get in the way. I gotta punch so quick here. That is not even what I meant to do, but it, it almost worked. But now we're in a big mess. Oh, geez. So you can see very quickly how this can get difficult. Okay, let's get rid of that one. Then if I could just find a way to punch this stuff away, go back over here, get rid of that one, and boom, we've solved it. So not only is it puzzle solving, but Really time-focused puzzle song. It's like Tetris, but even more intense somehow. <laughs> I love that little dance. That's great. So we're already pretty far into the thick of it, it feels like. That was one, two completed. We get our third gem for it. This is one, four. So yeah, let's do them in order. Over here, we have the bonus zone one, three. So what would this be? I seem to match a red and a green. But I guess it's maybe a little bit better piece. Oh no, I'm falling. Oh no. Okay, that restarts it. Can I wall jump? Oh, I can wall jump, that's nice. Very useful. Hmm. See, where this one gets tricky is, is, is how exactly we're gonna solve that, you know? Because I can do something like that, but I might just wanna fall and try again. It doesn't seem to be a problem to do that. Because I could yeah, just do that and then go over here, punch that there, aha! See, we're, we're figuring it out. And then I move over this way, and boom, we got it. So the bonus missions are gonna be a little bit trickier, but still pretty good puzzles to get done. A lot more of a relaxed pace, and we get three gems for that one. Quite the reward. And I guess I might open up this path down there a little bit. I guess I'll have to wait and see. A new item is available at Polo's Pawn Shop. Well, let me go check it out. So they have 38 coins. Just do a little bit of a spending spree, right? We'll see what's waiting for us. I want, can I, can I? No, wait, I don't wanna do that. <laughs> Let's get back here, I wanted to punch you. <laughs> I guess I can't. Welcome to the punch shop. Let's see what we can get. What else did they say, by the way? Well, why do I run a store here on the punch mountain? I like the climate, and the rent is quite reasonable. There's no shortage of customers either. The supposed treasure attracts many fools. But now back to business. <laughs> okay, so. We, we bought some of these bombs before. We could try the fire punch, which allows us to break the ice in a single hit. That'd be super convenient. We also now have the money bag, which increases the maximum number of coins you can hold from 99 to 999. And then the double jump. Oh man. I think we'll stay, keep it sim simple here. We'll use the fire punch and two more bombs. And can we leave from this side? Oh, we can. That's much better. So let's get back to it. One four is waiting for us. I think this is the last level of the summit. And for this one, we need one of three colors, red, purple, and green. So we can, no, punch this, I just gotta remember the controls. So actually, I definitely want that one down there, and then I just wanna get that there, and then boom, we're already done with it. That's fantastic. We get that one there, and punch away a bunch of stuff. But you know what, how do I wanna do this? I'm waiting for another green one. I'll punch it over there, and in the meantime, wait, wait, there we go. So fast moving is really gonna pay us off, or pay off for us. There we go, there we go. So punch this away, but here comes the rumble, and I guess that means there's a lot more blocks on the way. Oh, could I get more than one at once? Hold on. This could be a little bit of experiment. What if I were to do that, punch this here? Oh no, I messed it up, darn. I wanted to try to get four at once. I definitely could have, I just clicked the wrong button. Anyways, mission accomplished still, and we get 28 more coins for it. Okay, so we're solving things no problem. That's what we like to see. So there's one four in the summit completed. So what's going on down this way? This level will be Alpine Gate. Okay, so let's check out Alpine Gate then. Whoa. Okay, so for this one, we need a certain amount of gems, which we are well over the requirement. We just needed three, we had seven. Oh man, this is like a super gem. Whoa, okay. Hey, it's you again. 
Ah, it's you, my chubby friend. Very well done, you opened one of the four gates. <laughs> chubby? Sorry, I didn't mean to offend you. As I already said, you opened one of the four gates. Each gate will lead you further into the depths of Punch Mountain. And at the very bottom, the treasure lurks. I mean, waits for you? Anyway, I have some other things to do now, but it looks like you're doing great. We will meet again. All right, see ya. Oh no, I keep actually using the bombs when I mean the punch. I don't know, it feels like it should be the punch button to me. Anyways, that was the Alpine. Alpine zone unlocked. Cool, so I guess we need a certain amount of gems to get the certain things, so we'll just try to clear out this area now. We have Alpine zone at two, one. Wow, so for this one, we need four reds and two purples. Let's get to it. The music's pretty good already. Grab that coin, I'll leave that one there. Actually, yeah, that's fine for all of them. The only difficulty with this one is that there's this not a lot of space. Can I just, oh, okay, that's not working out the way I want it to. No, no, wait, this is not what I wanted. Uh oh, so that could be a huge issue. Okay, let's uh, think about this for a second. How do I want to do this one? My big coin! Okay, I got it, I got it. Okay, wait a minute. Can I sort of, no, come on. I'm so close to getting it to do what I wanted it to do there. What's the lightning do? Whoa, um, something, something huge. I need to get over here and punch this a little bit over to the side, come on. Got it, finally, oh my goodness, that was rough. I need to maybe punch that over there. No, 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 I know, I know. Hold on, give me a second here, give me a second. Oh my gosh, punch that over and boom, we get another purple. Okay, that's really good. Now if I could just, ah, uh, ah, don't, don't sink. No, wait, no, 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 come on. There's so much going on. That is just overwhelming. The difficulty has jumped up quite a lot, so it'll take us a lot of work. Gonna need some help. Get cool items at Polo's Pawn Shop. I know, I know. Let me get another try at this one. I think I could do it without the items first. I mean, obviously I can't really afford too many of the other new ones, but I can earn up coins this way. Yeah, that's sort of another thing though, is that as long as we're playing, we're gonna earn up coins, which will be great. Okay, you know what? I'll do that then. Because this one is four wide, which means I can do that, punch this here, and get stuck a little bit, but that's one of the matched up. Now I punch this over like this, and that's another one. So now I'm getting into the flow of it, at least a tiny bit more. I still don't really know, oh, the lightning seems to just clear out anything in that direction, huh? Okay, well, good to know. No, come on, that's not what I wanted at all. So I'll save that lightning for when we really need it, maybe? No, darn it, okay, it just destroys everything. This is sort of a mess so far. I'm going to try to, Huh, I don't know. I don't think I did that correctly at all. Oh, I'm, I'm sinking, I'm sinking. I need to go and break this step up right away. Okay, break that, move this over. There we go, there we go. I'm gonna have to do some wild stuff here, but yeah, I do have the bomb if necessary, but we broke one more of that color, so oh no. Okay, you know what? I don't know if I should've. Can I just do this? Oh, come on, come on. There we go, That's, that almost solves it. What if I put the bomb down? No, that's what the bomb does. Oh, come on, I thought it would clear out the gray blocks for me. Okay, those are just gonna fall in my favor, so that's nice. So now we don't need any more purples. We just need red twice, so any purple, I'm just gonna knock out of here. I keep missing the coins. Come on, I got that one. Break this open. That's another one. It's going a little bit easier on me now, which is good. Okay, so you can get a little two for one punch there, which I appreciate. Okay, punch this over. And then you, I need over sort of there. It's gonna solve itself. So even if it has four that line up, it only just chooses three of them. Oh man, so mission accomplished. That was so challenging now. That was definitely just like a huge difficulty jump. But hey, our little punch win friend seems happy about it regardless, so. That will be 2-1 completed. And what is this mystery over here? Russ's Punch Park. Oh hey, this is Russ. This seems cute. Howdy stranger, so you wanna play at the famous Punch Park? Punch Park? You have to try it, the most amazing prizes are waiting for you. Prizes? Amazing prizes, take a look here. Hey, we got some gems. I see I've got your attention. If you finish all three courses in the park, then these three diamonds are yours. Wanna get a ticket for Punch Park? Sure. 
Thanks, so let's go for another round. So how does this work? Oh man, I gotta hold X and then release it? Just at the right time, I suppose. Boom, that's gonna go pretty, oh. Okay, so I'm not supposed to let it go far. Just a certain amount of distance so it can land on the red. That's not so bad. Yeah, that counts, cool. But this time, whole different course available. But we do get three tries again, which is nice. So that was a little weak. We'll try again, maybe about here. Ah, uh, not even enough to get through that first hill. So we need to be pretty strong this time. I'm gonna say something more like this. Come on, ah, oh, not quite. Please try again. Well, that's pretty expensive in terms of coins, so I think I'll hold off and try again. Not bad, but I think you need to practice a little more. Just try again, you could do it for sure. I'll save it for some other time. But it was nice meeting you, Russ. Very fun little game you got there. In the meantime, though, we have 2-8 over there. Not what I need to worry about. We need to find 2-2, two, two, if possible. Um, I can spend 20 coins to open up this level, which has, I'd imagine, 2-2. Two, two. Yep, here it is. Awesome, so let's give this a try. We need to get one green and one red. Oh, this is a bonus mission then, for sure. So with these, I don't think it'll give us any extra blocks. Which is where things get really weird. What do I do about that, you know? Like I can do this. Oh, 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 let's try again. But I was getting it, I was getting it. So, punch that there and as you can see, now we can break this, punch it over, got it. So I sort of wanna do a similar thing on this side, I think, maybe. This is where it's just gonna take some experimenting. Not that, that, that's the opposite of what I wanted, but maybe that's why I need to use the ice to my advantage. And keep in mind, I haven't really thought about this too much, but we could sack them vertically, couldn't we? We could just sort of do that, but not that much. Okay, hold on, what if I were to break these two? Oh no, um, hmm. That might have not have been what I wanted. Okay, we'll try it though. Get these two over there and then punch it like that. But then this one is gonna go straight into the hole. So, so close yet so far. Let me try this one. You're kidding me. This is tricky though, for sure. Oh, whoa, okay, I could punch both of them. It's not an easy thing to do, but certainly doable. I don't know if that's what I was supposed to do, but yeah, if you just time it just right, you can do that. Okay, well, same deal as we had before. We need to use the ice to our advantage, but these definitely teach us some good strategies. Oh man, so that's always appreciated. We got it, three extra gems. So let's see what's next for us. What else is in store? That's a pretty nice addition to the whole thing. New items are available, a pole is punch shot because of that, but we don't have a ton of coins at the moment. So could we get to two, three? Where is that gonna be? That's two, eight. Two, five. See, that's sort of weird. We have to play the levels out of order? I guess so, I don't see any other way to get around, so we'll try to find five in Alpine zone. The music is so boopy though, I love it. Oh no, can I get that coin please? The coins get away so easily. You know what, let's do that. There we go, it's not so bad. And then if I could, hold on, hold on. Yeah, get that over, punch it over like that, that's an easy connect. And I sort of wanna do the same deal here, but then maybe, yep, go like that. That's gonna be one of the red ones matchups. So we're already getting way better at this. I'm sure there's a lot more we need to improve with, especially when I'm doing things like that, but you know what, overall, still not too bad. Yeah, I'll let this red one fall where it falls. And then, oh, I tried to punch it, but I sort of messed up the punch. So these ones still take a couple of hits. Okay, how do I want to do this then? Because I sort of messed it up. I think actually, it's fine. I can match this up like that, then go over here. And if I'm quick about it, we can get those three matched up, no problem. Get that there, move it over one more time. And then, ah, oh, darn. Okay, not gonna go my way like that then. Maybe if I were, I'm sort of stuck at the moment, okay. It's definitely a mess. I got squished. Oh, okay. No, it's fine. See, what do I do here then? I guess I would just move over like that. More keep falling on my head. Okay, this is where I can change something. I can go like this, go like that, and then there's another one here. 
So if we were to, oh, darn, 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 darn. Come on, mash that up, just like that. Now I gotta go a little bit crazy with this. And then I can just, hold on, punch that down, and then there you go. It made the match for me right at the end, but I was getting somewhere with it. Mission accomplished. Take a little bath as a celebration, and we'll grab ourselves another gem. So you can see this game has a pretty fast pace to it where we'll clear your levels left and right. But that should open a path over here to the left. And it does give us 45 more coins and new items are available, so definitely wanna take a look at them. So we're at 27 now. What is the ordering in these levels about? It's so weird. Okay, we're in an icy cave here. I probably just wanna keep those purple ones where they were. Oh, we got greens this time to match up, but I would like to get that one there, punch this to the side so they're all next to each other. And then this red one, ah, darn, I just, I'm not quite fast enough with it in a lot of situations. Okay, there we go, that one's gonna fall in a perfect spot though, which means if I could just punch this one here, punch it here again, boom, we already got another red lined up. I want that green one there instead. This red one, it can wait on top for now. Shaking definitely makes it harder to uh, keep up with, but. Okay. Hmm. I'm not getting anything I want here. There you go. Not even, it feels like the coins are going right through me. Do that one more time, and there is a purple matchup. That's the last purple we needed, so at this point, if I could just. I don't know. Making some critical mistakes, but I think we're fine. Because what we do is we just do this, punch that there, punch this here, and that's green matchup. So the red is the only thing we need, so we can punch this purple one away and wait for more red to show up. I gotta be careful though, because you know, this is happening. So maybe I could just, oh no, no you don't, no you don't. Get this over there. Oh no, but now it's a whole mess. Now it's an entire mess. How do I wanna fix this? As I get just about none of these coins that are getting launched over here. I think I want to, okay, that would be a huge help, sort of. Actually, yeah, we're fine. We're going to get that there, get this, maybe, okay, here we go. What's that flame now? I don't know. I guess we won't find out for now, but it sort of fell together eventually. So there's another mission accomplished and another gem for it. So at the least we made quick work at the levels. It definitely is a challenge at times, but for being a new player, I think we're doing fine. You know, we, we've only failed a couple of the levels. So this is 2-9, I'm so confused here on what I might have missed, but we'll spend our 20 coins to open this up. And this is 2-3. So yeah, it is just, I guess, a jumbled order with the actual level numbers, but this is just a bonus sound. Okay, let's go for it then. Um, hmm. So this is where things get really, really tricky, but I think I wanna do that for now. Oh, but those fall with it. And once we, we can't, oh no, we can move this, Never mind. I thought we couldn't, but we can. So it's gonna match up the red ones. Oh, but this is where things can maybe become a mess. Cause like, what do I do about this? I can't really do too much. It'd be cool if I could punch them up somehow or something, but I think we're sort of stuck here. So we'll reset it. How exactly do I wanna manage this? I think, Hmm, wait, wait, ah, no, not what I meant to do. I could try getting this one here, and then, for right now, let's just punch this to the side. And it's almost there. If I could just get this way over here, but get it out, out of here, we don't wanna see it. But then, no, we're sort of still in the same situation with this one. Yeah, it's not gonna work. We can't get it past there after that happens. It's definitely a bit of a troublesome, and I think I'm doing the same thing again, but. Yep, I just did the same thing again. So, that's not gonna work for us. Could just try to get one of these down. I feel like if I wanna do that, that's fine, but I should do it the other way. I should get this one here, get that one there, then we can maybe punch this to the side, punch this one just out of here. 
Yeah, okay, here we go. No, 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 this is not what I wanted. I was so close. Come on. Okay, things are pretty simple from here. All I need to do is hit this to the side, that matches, and then we hit these two over. That's what I was trying to do before, but I messed it all up. But this time, we got it. So that was another good one, and I'm actually able to grab most of the coins in time. Awesome. So I think we might, you know, try one more normal level, or maybe now's a good time to check out the shop. But hey, we're getting a lot of these gems. We're up to 13 of them. So you wouldn't have to necessarily complete everything to move forward, but definitely helps. And it seems like the more we complete, the more we unlock in the shop. So I'm very curious to see what other useful goodies we might have found. One of the punch shop. So what else do we have here? We got the uh, double jump, the every coin you, you collect counts twice. So that's really good. Increase your bomb bag capacity from three to 10. The ground pound smashes below ice box, press B and the other uses. So some really useful stuff here for sure. I think for right now though, we'd probably just wanna keep saving for this then, so that we can actually afford some of the more expensive stuff. So not quite at 99 coins, so I won't touch it too much. But I would very much like to try this one more time because it was fun. <laughs> so that's something we'll do to finish off today's video. We'll, we'll see if we can't get this figured out. So yeah, we'll wait, no, I'm ready, I'm good. I wanna go, pay a ticket, get started. So, like I learned a little bit about how to handle this before. I'm gonna hold X until about here. Uh, not quite strong enough. Okay, try it again. We don't wanna overthink it, but that's exactly what I'm doing. We just did the same thing twice. There we go, that's maybe too much. Oh man, okay, we're not so good at this one anymore. Please try again. Well, that's all the coins I have and maybe all the time we have. This is a very fun game though. We could definitely um, consider playing more of it if you guys want, if, as per usual with Zebra's Arcade episodes. If you wanna see more episodes, all you gotta do is let me know. If enough people really wanna see it, then maybe we can consider turning it into a full series. With that being said, that is gonna wrap it up for today's episode of Zebra's Arcade. Thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.